It is now time for a legal terminology game. I'm going to read random Latin words, and you Ooh. tell me how this applies in the law to okay. you. Okay. Are you ready? ready? <laughs> okay, let's start with this one. Who knows what ab initio is? Ab initio. Taking the initiatives ab. to do abs. Yeah, yeah you got to do your abs. <laughs> Every day. In Latin, this translates to from the beginning. It is commonly used to describe the time when a contract, statute, marriage, or deed first became legal. It was ab initio on June 20th, oh, 2021. Close to my birthday. There it is. I like that. <laughs> arbitration. Arbitra or arbitration. I made that with Ooh, you. Army? That sounds like a cologne. You, <laughs> a cologne. Try the new arbitration. <laughs> yeah. It will stop her in her tracks. <laughs> arbitration, a form of dispute resolution where both parties consent to being bound by the decision of an arbitrator chosen by both parties. Arbitration is used in the resolution of commercial disputes as an alternative to going to court. Okay. Still don't know what it means. But all right. <laughs> you still don't know what it means. After that, well, it's like a mini court it. before going all the way to court. Gotcha. So it might be handled a little cheaper. Bona fide or bona fide. Isn't it when something's fake? A bona fide. Uh, what do you think? Fire. Bonaf bonfire. Yes. Bon <laughs> Come over. I've got the great bona fide. Bona fide. I got the marshmallow. Bona fide. I'm gonna make a s'more. <laughs> bona fide is the opposite of fake. Oh, fake. Shit. It means in good faith, which uh, is an honest transaction without any intentions to deceive. So you were 100% wrong. exactly wrong. <laughs> but that's good. Thank you. Close. Caveat emptor. Sounds like caviar. Caviar. Mm, yes. Give empty, me a little... empty caviar. That's more it's caviar. It's food on the menu. I'm, I'm feeling emptor. It's a type of food on the menu. Caveat emptor. <laughs> Buyer beware. <laughs> buyer beware. This refers to the principle that the buyer is responsible for checking into the product before you purchase it. Oh. oh. We're learning a lot on this show. I definitely am. Yeah. <laughs> Eminent domain. I swear it sounded like Eminem. I was about to say Eminem <laughs> domain. Yeah. Yeah. Eminem owns website. all the rights to his own What music. was that again? Yeah. <laughs> Eminent domain is the government will pay a sum of money and be able to compensate your private land if they have a bigger project ready to go. What? Yeah. They can take my land. Yeah, if they want to build Good a train know. track that goes all the way through a part of town and you're like, not me, I'm holding out. <laughs> <laughs> Got my land right here. <laughs> they're, like, they're like, no, you don't. What? And they can take that land. She's smiling. Give me that. I ain't buying out here, though. All right. You're right. We're down to the last two. Malum in se. Maluma. Malum and say. Malum and sea. Malum and sea. Melon sea. I don't know. Melons in the sea. Uh, seedless watermelon? Yeah, yeah. No. <laughs> That's what I in Latin, wrong in itself, you are malum in sea. It refers to something that is seen as innately or inherently wrong, whether the law provoke. Uh, whether the law. <laughs> I'm reading it. Okay, I'm well, I don't <laughs> whether the law prevents it or not. Okay. Right, let's wrong. say they forgot to make a law about stealing or slapping her shoe or whatever in it. She's getting so mad. And I'm like, what? There's no law against that. You're like, malum and say. <laughs> <laughs> With the accent. Yeah, 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 yeah. that accent. That would be good. Uh, <laughs> Oliver Twist. We're learning a lot. Yes. Finally, in Paris, delicto. In Paris, delicious. 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 Paris. You're thinking about food. Yeah, darling, I'm hungry. <laughs> this, is, this is not one of the menu items delicto at Delicto is Garden. like, it's like delicate. In Paris, delicto. So yeah. you're saying is in it? Paris, this is considered delicate. Delicate, delicate. yeah. <laughs> no. That means equal offense. A situation where both parties are equally at fault. Oh. Yeah, so if you guys okay. are both pulling out of Trader Joe's and then you uh. both hit each other, I'll say, in Paris, delicto. <laughs> and that's final. All right, that's enough of interpreting laws. And I'm now hungry for Italian food. So. <laughs>